my name is Dave Irby. I'm a faculty member here at the Adventure Sports Institute through Garrett College, and I teach a lot of classes both in the field and in the classroom. My name is Lauren Mann. Um, I'm a sophomore at Garrett College. I've received four foundation scholarships here, and it's meant a lot to me. Hi, my name is Dr. Sean Beachy. I'm an instructor of music here. Uh, I teach piano and voice. Composition private lessons. I'm Shelley Manier. I'm the director of equity and compliance at Garrett College. I received funding through the Faculty Professional Development Scholarship to attend a two-day training um, offered by ATICSA, who is the Association of Title IX Administrators, um, to attend a civil rights investigator training. I applied for the Garrett Pride uh, Opportunity Grant. Uh, I thought this would be a great opportunity to get a new keyboard so my students can practice. And uh, I wanted an electronic keyboard because they can use headphones. So they get this little adapter because it's a quarter inch input here on the key keyboard and they can use the same headphones that they use for their phones, which is really cool. We received $510 for myself and five students to travel to Brewston Mills and attend the Association for Experiential Education Mid-Atlantic Conference. And at that conference, we were also able to present, uh, including students and myself, and we gave an hour-long presentation on integrating STEM technology into adventure pursuits and recreation. It's a lot of money to go to other schools, and because of Garrett, I've been able to get the degree that I wanted to get here, the math and science degree that I'm pursuing, and hopefully move on and further my education. I have a little bit of funding for piano tunings, um, and educational materials, but not enough funding for a new keyboard. Um, and so uh, the grant helped me purchase this where otherwise I wouldn't have been able to. Putting together the proposal and eventually receiving the funds was really influential in students' experience here, uh, both because they had to put together a grant, put together a proposal, and they actually wrote the proposal to the foundation. And so ultimately receiving the funds allowed us to travel to Bruce and Mills and attend the, the two-day conference, which we would not otherwise be able to attend through just department funds. I just appreciate the fact that the opportunity for this scholarship and funding is there personally for me, but I think uh, it's great for any employee that's looking to further their training, their knowledge, and, and their experience. I think it's a great program college offers um, for these kind of projects where it can be budgeted in the college uh, annual budget, um, but it's a necessity. For them. So it's, I think it's a very important project and I think it should continue, not just for me, but everybody who, who needs something here on campus, all of the instructors um, could benefit over, over time um, through that kind of funding. We, we really appreciate all the, the donor funds because it does allow students to do kind of extracurricular op opportunities outside of the classroom. This was an opportunity that was way beyond the scope of the classroom, but develops our students into kind of more well-rounded professionals in the field and also help with uh, networking opportunities. It meant a lot to me to get every single scholarship that I've gotten, and without them, I know that I would not be where I am today.